Hello. In Nomad Sculpt, um, there's a new feature or um, a new tool, uh, Radial Symmetry. The version of Nomad Sculpt is 1.55. Um, I switched to the app. Um, okay, I created uh, this. Um, it's okay <laughs> let's test it um, we add a sphere for example um, and I validate it and in the symmetry is now um, an, it's now possible to um, select the axis um, I show the plane on the model uh, on the on our ball um, this has also changed uh, there are now the planes uh, visible um, blue green and red uh, in this case um, and you can activate um, all of the axes or only one or two um, okay and for example, um, we use the uh, Y axis, then we can um, set a account um, how many um, yeah, things appear around the uh, symmetry center. Um, for example, 10. And now you can use uh, the brushes or the tools um, for example we use the move tool I go I switch to the front view and I move this out and one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay I one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yes um, the count is correct um, and it does like uh, it works like this um, there are many many possibilities or um, um, now to do um, and you can also um, now add a X um, and test it what happens um, I change okay and now the count okay the count stays um, but nothing happens Symmetry is on. Okay. Let's go back a few steps. I'm all it's so it's so brand new that I'm also testing. Um, you can use the mask it for sure. Um, we can use, um, for example, this alpha. And okay, I go to the settings of the brush and change it to this and use the grab dynamic radius. Um, and I subdivide it. Um, okay and I use a brush what happens now uh, okay nice very very nice um, 
and I change the axis okay it's um, it's then possible to Let's do something like this. Um, brush and use a normal brush. And when ah, you can make a wheel, <laughs> okay. Ah, that's really good. In, you have to test it yourself. Um, the tool is here. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.